Hello and thanks for watching the Ancient Speak. Let's learn Chinese from the wisdom of the ancients. First, let me introduce to you a key Chinese word that will frequently appear in the following episode. Dao. The basic rhetoric of Dao looks like a kid's scooter, isn't it? It is placed on the left of many other Chinese characters as well. This radical means to walk. The right part of Dao is shou, which is itself a Chinese word, meaning the head or the very beginning. Again, the pronunciation of this word is dao. The basic meaning of dao is the path and the method. As a verb, it also means to say. As some of you may have already learned, dao is the central concept of ancient Chinese teacher Lao Tzu's thought referring to the source of all the universe or the way. Lao Tzu, in his book Dao De Jing says, Dao Zhe, Wan Wu Zhi Ao. Dao Zhe, Wan Wu Zhi Ao. Dao, the way. Zhe is an auxiliary word referring to this type of person or this type of thing. And here, it helps to make a little pause in the sentence. Wan Wu, all things. Zhi is also an auxiliary word. Ao, always say Ao Mi, meaning the secret. Teacher Lao Zi is saying, Dao, or the way, is hidden deeply in all things. The way governs all things. Can we help the shoots grow by pulling them upward? Can we order the sun moving here and there? Do we give the horse its might? Do we command the eagle who mounts up and makes its nest on high? Yes, there are marvelous secrets in nature and its masterful design. Let's review what we learned today. Dao Zhe, Wan Wu Zhi Ao. Dao Zhe, Wan Wu Zhi Ao. Dao, the way. Wan Wu. All things. All, the secret. Lao Zi is saying that Dao or the way is hidden deeply in all things. The way governs all things. Again, Dao Zhe, Wan Wu Zhi Ao. Dao Zhe, Wan Wu Zhi Ao. Dao. And thanks for watching the ancient speak and learning Chinese together through their wise old sayings.